Hey, it's Allison. I've been a math teacher for 15 years, and today I want to show you how to find the equation of a line in point-slope form. So we need two points to define a line. So I'm going to use these two points, 3 minus 5 and 6, 2. Now, point-slope form looks like this. y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. Now, in this equation, m is the slope. x1 and y1 are specific x and y coordinates, and x and y are my variables, my independent and my dependent variables. So here's what you do. The first thing you have to do is find the slope, and we use our points for that. So slope is the difference in the y coordinates over the difference in the x coordinates. So I'm going to find the difference in my y coordinates. On the top, I've got a negative 5. I'll use, I'm using this one. And I have to subtract from my other y coordinate, which is 2. And then on the bottom, I have to take the difference in my x coordinates. So I'm going to take 3 minus 6. OK, so negative 5 minus 2 is the same as saying negative 5 plus negative 2. So that's a negative 7. And on the bottom, I have 3 minus 6, which is the same as saying 3 plus negative 6. So I get a negative 3 on the bottom. Now I have a negative 7 over a negative 3. That's the same as 7 thirds. So the slope of my line that joins these two points is going to be 7 thirds. Now here's how you put it in point-slope form. We're actually almost done. We have y minus y1 equals, I'm going to put the slope in instead of writing m, my slope is 7 thirds, x minus x1. Now, all I have to do is plug a specific value in for x1 and a specific value in for y1, and I'm done. And you can use either of the points that we started with to find the slope. I'm just going to use the point 6, 2. But you could easily just as well use the point 3, negative 5. It doesn't matter. They're both correct. So here's what you do. For y1, put in the y coordinate. y minus 2 equals 7 thirds times x minus, instead of x1, put the x coordinate in, which is 6. So an equation of this line in point slope form is y minus 2 equals 7 thirds x minus 6. And if you do some algebra and rearrange this, you'll get the equation in slope intercept form. That's how you find the equation of a line in point-slope form. Thanks for learning with me today. If you'd like more information on any of the topics, click on the links below. And be sure to rate, comment, or subscribe to our channel. If you have a specific request, please send it to requests at mahalo.com. I'll see you next time.